go looking at me looking at you hold up where you going what you doing who you see what you need what you want i said without you by my side my side my side without you by my side one time one time from side to side without you by my side i can go outside without you by my side i can go outside without you by my side i can go outside
I don't know how to get this all time. What? Hi. So, I forgot to uh, mute myself. Before I got to get my charger or my headphones. Oh. Hello, hello. It's been a while. Sorry about that. <laughs> Catherine Gino, thank you for the follow. Oh, I really need to update those bars. I'll do that another time. It's cap, mind you. Yes, I'm aware, Gina. Thank you. It's a pleasure to have you here. Um. So. Um, <laughs> oh. so me, uh, first thing that I personally would like to say is I am sorry for the inactivity recently. I have, uh, been planning to get back to streaming for a while, but from the head injury to the sickness to the you need thank you for the sub the seventeen months. It is awesome to have you back. Um, so, yeah, I am sorry for the activity from the hand injury to the sickness to the, I don't know, lack of motivation. They have me so it's some marine clothing. No, thank you. I don't think that would look nice on me. But I do apologize for the inactivity. I am extremely sorry it took me so long to get back to streaming. Um... There's been a lot on my mind recently. Hopefully, all of you have been doing okay. The second thing I need to apologize for is that we're not doing anything special for today, even though it's Wedgie Wednesday. So, sorry for that, I... I was honestly fine for my fighting against myself. Um... To decide if I was even going to stream or not today. But you're the day. Thank you for that. Um. <laughs> so there's some things that I generally would like to talk about. So it's such a cool do thing. Um, there's a few things that I personally want to get off my chest and I want to talk about. Um, As of next week, I will probably not be posting a schedule anymore. On 
will be Discord. At the very least, I, I will not be uh, putting up a schedule from now on. Because I've learned recently that I really hate looking at schedules. And seeing that time frame that I schedule for myself, it always makes me hesitant and okay, it makes me <laughs> sorry. I've... I've been trying. I promise. Um... So yes, I will that be posting any schedules. I will still be streaming. And it will be most likely at the normal times, you know, the, the 12 p.m. or 1 p.m. central time, depending on how I feel. And uh, I'll get together with Captain Gina every at every time that I wish to stream to see if they want to play some games. And we're gonna we're gonna make it work even though there's not gonna be a schedule. I'm gonna try and post in the end advance. If I'm filling up for it. <laughs> I appreciate it, Gina, but um we are going to be just talking today. But that's how we're gonna be doing the quote unquote schedule from now on so because uh, every time i make the schedule why and i am i'm looking at it and i'm not feeling up to it i feel extremely guilty for not actually streaming and it takes a toll on my mental health really bad I really appreciate all the patience that has been going around for me lately and all the help people have given me. I actually... I watched a video last night of some, uh, therapists that were reviewing Encanto. And... It actually helped me realize something. Listening to them talk and how they were going on about the movie. I've never actually seen Encanto and I plan to watch it now. Um, I'm not sure exactly how to word this. Um, I have been extremely and utterly focused on helping people. And... It has been another mind-wrenching fact that I have recently needed help from some people and friends that I've, I have been getting and they have been very supportive of me. And one of the things about Encanto that the therapists were on about was that they're supposed to be the ones helping people, not the ones getting help. And when that came up, I felt my mind kind of break a little bit. Because I realized that what I was trying to do, it might seem like pride rather than actually trying to help people. And I don't want it to seem like that. But 
spent my entire life, I was raised to basically not want help. But anything that I'm in, I could get through it alone. And trying to break that mentality has been very hard. And it's been very mind breaking, mind numbing. I don't know how to actually describe it, but it's. It's not easy, really. Trying to accept help from people when the only thing I want to do is help them, not be helped. <sighs> I'm not good at accepting help. I'm not good at accepting compliments. I'm... I'm not good at asking when I need help. Then I phrase it in very odd and uncertain terms. But I've realized that I sometimes can't get through it alone. Music is like suburbi. Unfitting for what we're talking about. Oh, Either way, um I I do appreciate the patience.
I do personally want to think, even though I know that they're not in the stream right now and they're not watching. There are some certain friends I'm not gonna name by specific fact that I'd like to think. Not by, I'm not gonna specifically name them, but I personally would like to thank them. That they have been very... ...present and there. And they've been very helpful. And I hope that they do understand my appreciation for them. I'm already even all like Wedgie for five minutes, come on! Oh. I'll do the normal way to act at the 5 minute of all my thing. But, I do also want to thank uh, Captain Gino with, Gino over there for trying to keep me on my schedule and though the way they went about it sometimes wasn't exactly the Fast and when I described some of what I was feeling, they kind of backed off, and I'm sorry if I stopped the chew. It was not my intention. Either way, I do still appreciate you being there for me, Captain Gina. Gina has been one of the people who have been in my, uh, DMs for the while that I've been away in. We played some games every now and again. We played Terraria for a little bit. And then... After, uh, like, the second time we were playing it, I helped. Extremely horrible for myself, so I kind of backed um, we haven't played anything since. Uh, speaking of which, I haven't played a single video game since last time we played Terraria. It's kind of bad for me. I took some time back since your rather unfortunate moments. I did poke you right now, let's see how you were, so I definitely didn't stop back this one. Very fair, you have been... ...decently acting like a manager for me, and I have been very appreciative of you checking in, even though I don't normally say much. So... Um, I'm getting paid too, and after all of my goals are taken care of, I'm probably going to need some help from a friend again. But I've got someone to help me with that already, so don't worry. Everything's fine. Um, the only little thing that I have is I'm probably going to be getting a Final Fantasy XIV subscription again. And I'm probably going to be playing that a lot. At least, I haven't really in the mood to play Final Fantasy XIV again. <laughs> okay, five minutes less. Wish you could do Final Fantasy XIV again, but it's shuttered murder. Have that person jump on you like a rapid dog. I mean, that's a perfectly understandable reason not to play. But still. I've been wanting to play Final Fantasy XIV again, and if I get a subscription, I am definitely going to stream it every now and again. Yeah, 
Yeah, some people just don't know how to take it out a notch and just let people enjoy the game for what they are. But I will be. I just said I'm gonna be trying. Hopefully, I can actually play it with the voice changer on. Might be a hard wish considering it's heavier than Baldur's. It seems like it would be heavier than Baldur's. But my computer runs Final Fantasy 14 perfectly. No lag, nothing like that. I've played it on this PC before and... I've, uh, streamed it to, like, friends over Discord every now and again. Alex, the chocolate has redeemed a one, a one minute atomic glitch. Dude, one sec. One minute, it's all about you. Let's go. Uh, might take too much memory. That is something to consider, but I guess we'll just have to try it. See if it works. I'm playing the no armor core game. It's fire. I never really heard of Omicron, and I haven't really seen anything about, about it. But people say it's kind of like Dark Souls. Oh, that reminds me. I have a... Little story to tell you guys about my work night last night. So, I work at like this home improvement place, and I unload truck for it. unload truck onto pallets and whatnot. So, like there are two people inside the truck putting the uh, freights on these conveyor belt, this like manual conveyor belt to slide it out to the people who are stacking and I'm not here stacking with one of my favorite co-workers and I hear from inside the truck they're talking about video games like fighting games other things like that and I hear this one of the higher up guys mentioning that he's been playing Boulder's Gate recently. Ugh. Oh my neck. And my initial reaction to him saying that he's been playing Boulder's Gate was to stream. Fuck you. And they. It was my initial reaction because I can't stream it. So it means I'm probably not going to be playing it very often or at all. Me and Captain Gina over there have a... Little... Um... Me and Gina have a little offline profile that we're playing on and we just haven't gone back to it so i was really just really angry that they were talking about Baldur's gate and i i couldn't participate because i can't stream it Uh. 
bit of a bad thing yet, it'd be great. I'm pretty sure it would be. But like... Uh, between my actual games of D&D &D and not actually playing any video games at all, uh, but I've been... Uh, I did see that they... Uh, a friend of mine in a Discord group that I'm in posted a link to a mod that added quite, quite a lot of new races to the game. But, unfortunately... They have not added Catgirl. Not yet, at least. They're working on it. Then when they had Catgirl, I'll probably start playing it on my own. Not gonna lie. So, while I have been away, there have been a lot of things that have happened. And a few things that I want to share. If I can remember them. We should do Terraria with Calamity with Twitch coming in between. Screwing this over. I will give that some thoughts. Cause... Terraria is an okay game, but I don't know if I can play it anymore. I won't be probably spending their points trying to kill you more as they would probably be spending their points trying to kill me. Seven days is like Real laggy for me though. But it's definitely worth a try. We can we get the try eventually. But the Tarlin also has a specific targeting. Ooh, that's different then, I guess. Um, I remember that I started to realize something when I was working one night. And I brought this up to one of my friends the other day. What to all the Twitch chatters. Yeah, but like, if it costs money, then like, I don't particularly want to put that in because like, well, maybe it's a good way for interactions and such. It's... <sighs> like, I know it's mods, Gina. I know. You've tried to explain it to me before. But I have realized recently, um, I've started to hate my job again. Unfortunately. And it's more of a... I think it's more of a depression kind of thing than it is, like, actually hating my job. But that's easy. At least I don't stand behind a very realist time. Perfectly, perfectly acceptable argument. I am not in... constant, uh... You know. Baggity, because I'm over here all the time. They actually have, like, water bottles around the store and, like, these coolers that we can pick up every now and again. And they're actually cold, so they help out. But... 
Yes, I had I realized that for a job point, mainly because of, like, depression reasons. And... I think it might just be a case that I just don't like working. But then again, it's a job, so... I'm not supposed to typically like it all that much, huh? Well, aside from not work stuff, I want your guys' opinions on something. I have been wanting to write again. Though I haven't had any particular ideas. Would it pick up this channel or get high for revenue? Oh no. Look, Nina. If we start making money, then we start making money. And I'm not gonna look a gift horse in the mouth, but I'm not like asking people to like subscribe and do all that kind of stuff. Uh, that being said, from the future, if you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It is free on YouTube. While on Twitch, that is called a follow. Which I highly, uh, request that people start doing. Because if you subscribe to the channel on YouTube, that gets us, you know, more subscribers, that gets us up there, and that allows us to have our content reach other people. And it brings us higher up, and the more subscribers we get, the higher chances that, you know, we get noticed, and there's a higher chance that, um, the YouTube channel might actually take off. Which, by the way, um, we posted two videos on YouTube. The original talking stream where I have introduced this voice of mine. And the Barrow Trauma stream. And the Barrow Trauma stream with Captain Gina. And both of them are over 200 views. Which I am severely impressed with but in the like few weeks that they were posted we went from like 20 subscribers and we're now at 42 which is impressive and i know it's not easy to spread like news about this kind of channel going around Cause we do some, you know, we we do weddies. That's not exactly a common thing, and some people don't like getting that out there that they watch this kind of content. Cause it can be embarrassing. I completely understand that. Do you in mind that subs can be lost to inactivity? Yes, Julia, I am aware. Thank you. I'm doing my best. Are there people worse than you can start in a particular stream with that as they said be? If full on psycho. Okay. They are famous. Oh. Well, like I'm I'm not gonna rag on other people's content. But like, if they can make it there, then we could probably make it there. So like, let's get to, you know, sharing the channel. Sharing the Twitch, sharing Twitter. We have 2,000 people on Twitter. Over like 2,400 people on Twitter. But like, None of them actually come to circus, which is okay, because they also do our beats, so, like, understandable. But, like, if we do start sharing the channel, we can get more people, we can get more viewers, we might get more subs, which means more goals, higher subs, then the higher the 
risk on the factors go. I might go from playing, like, Phasmophobia, which is a multiplayer thing I could do with Gina, to, like, say... I don't know. Actual horror games like Amnesia or things like that. These are much. <laughs> Cap is bored. Well, Cap, I don't really know what to tell you. It's a just chatting stream. This is literally all we're doing today. So, yeah, spread the channel around and we might, uh, we might actually make it higher up. Yeah, that'd be the issue that no one really... Well, I mean... Even just like a simple retweet on like... Or I guess it's called a repost now. On like X or otherwise known as Twitter. Uh... Could be decently fine. It doesn't have to be anything big. Just like, you know, share links, share your favorite clips. Share all kinds of stuff. Oh, that I guess I can like get another account of Captain Gina. That's up to you. I'm not asking or forcing anyone to do things. Wait, share the channel, don't share the channel. It'll be up to you. But like, it could really help us out as a community and really help out. And like, every share could draw some extra attention. Oh, that hurts. Oh, ow. Over. Looks like every, everything we do to like, Captain Mizo is like a dynamic duo, one is a nerd, the other is a <laughs> Uh, I love that. I really love that. I've lost my sanity a long ago. No hope. I should make clips from my game and stream and post on TikTok. I would love to. I don't know how to do that. Like, I... I don't even have a TikTok. I don't think I... TikTok is a kindly word. That is where you are wrong, Gia. I have seen several wedgie videos on TikTok. Don't ask. <sighs> Fair enough. I personally don't know a lot about TikTok either, but that is a good idea, Sarbatch. Um, don't ask. You are the queen of buddies. I am the queen of buddies. Um, what would help is that, like, I don't like asking people to do a lot for me, but, like, getting, like, clips of like favorite moments from streams on the channel i could go through my entire stream and i will never find a single piece of a clip that i like personally because i'm a pessimist that's how i think so if i could get like one or two viewers like clipping their favorite parts of streams and something like that then I could use those to put on my TikTok. I hate to ask people to do that for me. But, like... Uh, that's really the only thing I can do. So, this is me asking you 
Please help me. Help me find these good moments. Help me find these. I need moderators to help me. Well, I would love to assign some moderators. I'm like, I have a few. I don't really watch anymore. Mizo, Queen of Nerds and Wedgies. Gia, Captain of this Extra Holy Ship. Yes, I stole. For having 200 viewers, I have like one moderator. Maybe two. And they don't come to stream anymore, so I need to. I need to find people for moderators, so like. If you watch streams. If you're in the Discord, send me a DM. Ask to be a moderator for like the Twitch channel. And I will see what I can do. Like if you feel like you can be there for most if not all the streams. I will I'll I'll, I'll work for I'll, I'll work I'll work around. I will do what I can. AJ 2 game Master 9, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the community, I hope you enjoy your stay. <laughs> Do you know though? That's how this works. <laughs> I have some free time to probably look at old streams and watch for funny moments. Okay. Uh, if you would do that for me, Falcon. And, like, present to me some of what you think is the best moments from those streams. If you could send them to me, like, little clips. I know we have, like, a lot of clips here until I'll get to the atomic wedge in just a second. After, put it on side. Um. Uh. It would be absolutely fantastic if you could like link those to me over discord please thank you okay let's go can at least keep it on some things. I do not have the power to put them on the barrel and remove them. But aside from that, I can keep an eye on Little Miso. Do not call me Little Miso. I am not small. I'm pretty sure I am taller than you. I am not small. Thank you. What? No! I'm not small! I'm tall. I'm real tall. No! How dare you! Stop insulting your queen! I'm already in the moment, would you ruin me? Give me a second. Really hard song. It was, um... I'm just here. I'm just a friend here. Like, do you say that, Gina? Of like, you have been <laughs> one of the driving forces 
army for a while. You're glad you can make it the toy with me. How dare. How dare you. I do appreciate everyone being here. That's really nice. I'm also not a pirate, I am a marine officer. Well, that reminds me, there is like one funny moment I can remember from the Barrow Trauma stream that we did, Gina. Uh, my first death was incredibly funny to me. So they... I could go on to, like, YouTube and try and get a clip of that. Time work around it. Because it's not on Twitch anymore, unfortunately. Here it's been past the two weeks that it actually stays. But, like, that death was not really funny, in my opinion. I got trapped in, like, the, like, tiniest little hole that wasn't really supposed to be on the ship. The virtual strength was great. There are possibly it. There are probably enough possible clips with just me. Gina! Little self centered there. Like you're aiming straight at a box. I think you forget, Gina, that the camera is focused on my character. Because, you know, I'm the favor. Oh yes, we do have some merch! It is, uh, on the Stream Elements store, and... There's also the first boss of that Souls game. Perfectly fair. Perfectly fair, yes. It is... Oliver. Oliver Collins. But yes, we have merch. Well, there are some, like, mouse pads. We've got a mug. We've got, I think, a shirt and a hoodie. It's been a while since I've looked. But, like, there are some, like, uh, mouse paths and modes that have some art or emoji on them. There are stickers too, yes. I want to get a plushie, but there is absolutely no way with the following we have right now that I'm gonna get a plushie. If we actually get, like, a major following and, like, I start making big money but there's definitely a chance i'm going to try and commission someone to make plushies a wedgieable plush i don't think any like actual company might actually endorse that it might just have to be a normal plushie but i'll do what i can Uh, I want to play Old Marine again. Now that we're thinking about, like, Souls likes, I want to play Old Marine. No!
I want to play Elden Ring. That is why I said Elden Ring. We still need to get that game. It is a fantastic game. I love every second playing it. But when I sold my PS4 to uh, get some money to pay the bills a little while ago when I was in a dire spot, um, I had to sell my PS4. I won't stole my progress, unfortunately. So at first. <laughs> when a game she'd like to see me as a play play people with or without Gina. I would love to ask that, unfortunately, uh how all the games people want to see I don't have money for? Yeah, I know you just asked it, but like... I don't have money. I can't just buy... games that people want to see. I have to work with what I have. If there are any games people have recommendations for, especially if they're like cheaper games, like on the side of like maybe five bucks. If you want a decent road like Ember Knights one, okay, I'll I'll remember that. Send me send me the name or Discord, Gina. Uh, I'll give a lore. Happy to see ya. We've been having a decently nice just chatting stream. Everything has been going decently wonderful. Uh, we talked about some things that have been going on with me and how uh, I want to get some clips so I can actually all of flow chat messages but uh, please give some game recognitions I can't English nothing really comes to m oh my god but it really comes to mind I'm not sure what people would want to watch I did play a battle royale like PUBG or no No. I am not playing Fortnite. I refuse. A PUBG, I can give a try. But I'm not playing Fortnite. Like, I decently enjoy Battle Royales. PUBG's okay. I actually have this game on my Steam called Eternal Return, which is absolutely free. Um, and that, that one's pretty nice, that one's pretty good. I enjoy playing it solo. Me and Gina used to play it with a friend of mine. My cousin, actually. Um, but like, 
It is really it's a really neat little game. It is a battle royale, just not guns, and it's top down, like kinda like League. But with like a crafting system set. So I might give that a try on stream if everyone is uh looking for that. Uh play single player games? I do have a lot of single player games. I personally just don't find a lot of them. Um because I, I really enjoy playing games with other people, but I do have games I can play single player. So, I can definitely plan for some of those in advance. Starbound! No thank you! Uh, space, space games, uh... Space games do not hold my interest. Pro Force. What is Pro Force? I don't think I've heard of that. America. What? It's hard. Okay, Gina, I'll just I'll just let you do you and you can explain it to me later. Um So yes, uh brr. You are cute. No, you're cute. Expected that. One of the favorite things people used to do on the channels every time I denied being cute, they would give me a fudgy. All I can say is bad jokes, sequel, murder, lots of explosions, and a lot of real. Figures turn bro. Now I'm just confused. But yes, um, if we could get some people, I could show it. Um, maybe another time. Unfortunately, uh, I've got about another hour left, and then I have to go get ready for work. Because I do work tight. Uh, but, yes, um, as I have been trying to say, um, if we can get some people taking clips of, like, their favorite moments, and, uh, of, of streams and the videos that we post, it could really help with some spreading like youtube shorts or just like little clips that we can take and we can post on like tiktok or whatnot i'm not expecting much from it honestly but like it's something we could try Oh, I'm tired. Right, the yeah, you're not allowed. You're not allowed to post links in the Twitch chat. Okay, I'll look at that later. 
I don't wanna play it out on stream. Tapped up and denied. Unfortunately, yeah. It was just a short... about on my mind um Draw force is kind of a shooter old style game with a lot of enemies you can die very easily but get more lives as you rescue oh oh okay 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 um i think i know what you're talking about i think like mark played the Room setting fun talking. I'm glad you're having fun. I could imagine how some people might think this is boring. But, uh. Yeah, Markler. I've been, like, watching Mark's videos for, like, years and years. I mean, I'm bored and just thinking on how I can make myself suffer in a Minecraft pack. But playing Civilization VI with my friends in the middle of a Cold War with one of them over some resources. Oh no. So six is pretty fun though. I don't know if it's something to play on the channel though, it's pretty slow paced. Yes, I've been a fan of Markiplier for quite a few years. I've watched a lot of his stuff, and he is one of the reasons I started uh, actually streaming myself. Uh, the military buildup is real. The one I want to do is Valkyrie. In space, I have not washed Mark Iyer in space. That is my one cardinal sin. I have not actually checked that out. I haven't had time to sit down and experience it for what it is. I'm going to continue the electric back room last night. I hope you have there so much. I hope you have a lot of fun with it, Halkin. It sounds like it's going to be entertaining. Valeria is basically a back with a lot of death based around modscape and run parasites. I've never heard of either of those, so if you have fun with that, Gina, then you can have fun with that. You know, I'm not really sure to tell you. Like, I could say I could play, but like, I, I, I don't know, cause I, I don't particularly enjoy Minecraft all that much. Uh. And that 
game if I win I deny the friend access to enter which means no go oh. Which means no guns then that's an evil thing to do. Oh no, I was fighting for, against myself to decide if I was actually going to stream today or not. Because I had some trouble sleeping last night. I'm happy that I started stream today. Because we've gotten some good conversations and... And I've gotten a few ideas of things I could do to help the channel grow even if I don't stream. Sleep. I wish I had shorter nights. I just wish I could sleep. It's not easy. It's not easy trying to go every day with like four hours of sleep. Only thing is I have like 400 military strength and I got 200. But I'm catching up. That's an interesting way of fight. I wish you luck in your battles ahead. I know how I know a bit of how some sex works. I I played it on my own and with some friends that I just haven't played in a while. Oh, three hours after. No, that's bad. Get rest. Please take care of yourself. I'm up for one that tries in the afternoons and at midnights. I go to gym late nights. Oh no. Guys. I guess I can't say anything as long as you're healthy, then I should be happy. Oh, therapy down for a civilization stream. I'll consider it. Mainly because I just, uh, I don't particularly enjoy playing that specific game alone. If I do play, I play with mods. Uh, I'm not gonna joke around, I play with mods. I don't like anything, I just am not good in PvP. Yeah, you don't gotta worry. I, I don't do PvP a lot. I know there are some games I used to play on the channel, like Grand Blue Fantasy Versus, that I kind of like it back into. But I only played in like the arcade mode, and I rarely played, uh, ranked. Just to, you know, fight some other people. I highly doubt anyone that watched those streams is still here besides maybe Uni. But, uh, I don't play a lot of versus games because I get very competitive. Brother Zomboy can be interesting. Do you think it would be interesting? Until I die stupidly and horribly. Because of my own mistakes. I am not smart. It make her great clips though, I suppose that's fair. Sadly do not like space games since Cosmeteer is a great one. Uh, I don't think I've ever actually heard of Cosmeteer. You make your own chips. Yeah, see? The creative part I'm not very good at. 
Cause I'd go with like a basic bare bones chip and I just did that. Okay, let's go. Yeah, but the thing is, yeah, with that kind of game, I would just, i place it, but not really do much with it. Balloons Tower Defense is entertained. I have that. I do have that. I have, uh, Balloons 2D6. I have mods to make some things easier. Okay. I'll know if you add it. It will be part of it. What? Yeah, fair enough. Still. Uh, Rimworld was not my cup of tea. Owns the inner working ship, control the ship. Okay. Well, still, I don't like space games, so unfortunately, that is a no from me. More than likely, at least, I might take my later on when I actually have the money. Subnautica. I have that. Don't make me play it, please. Don't make me play Subnautica. I beg of you. I do miss some games with Chris and plans these days, like most. Or just, here's a pre made one, enjoy. Subnautica is not one. No, no, no. No, thank you. I do not want. Uh, you know what? Fine. For anyone listening to this. For anyone that is watching this in the future or currently at the moment. If we get 20 subscribers on Twitch. And I know this is a big ask. We get 20 subscribers on Twitch, which is like 11 more. I will play Subnautica on stream more at the very least. I will attempt to, if my computer can run it. I make a big request because I am afraid. And it's like, it's a lot easier to reach actually at the moment because it's September. Anyone watching on YouTube or Twitch, it's September. Like, like, um, uh, fucking subs are discounted at the moment. So like, yeah. AJ2K Master 9, thank you for the sub. Um, the bar at the top is wrong. Um, if I am correct, um, my dog, welcome to the panty folders, thank you. I very much appreciate it. Welcome to our community, and I, I love and enjoy you. Um, we should be at 10 subs now. Which means... Phasmophobia! Eventually. 
myself for funsies. Well, we've hit the 10 sub goal, so that's before we are on stream. So let me just... <sighs> Just this. I'm not small. Oh, there you I am not small. Asma was weird? That was entertaining, Hermie. Somebody can host it, so Sid Mons. We'll definitely get into that then. Um. So yeah. Um. The goal has changed. Uh, since we hit 10 subs. We will eventually be playing Phasmophobia on stream. And... Uh, if we get 10 more subs, I will do a... Something like a playthrough. Or at the very least, I will try, hoping my computer can handle it. Hello, 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 everyone who is recently joining the stream. Welcome to the stream. I hope you enjoy your time here. We are a very close community here. And I hope you enjoyed your time. Currently, today, we are simply just chatting. How to convince Mizo to make me a moderator and regret it. Gina! You are one of the people I really trust. I would make you a moderator in a heartbeat. But that also means you have to, like, work with me on certain things. It is vibes o'clock. Yes. Vibes all day every day. Tell me what, um, well, my dog died. I don't know. I haven't thought about it yet. Um. She knows power. Um, my... That may seem better than actually a person, but people don't lie to them. Don't lie to them. <laughs> um, but... What was I going to say? Basically, do you know, we, we just want to keep, like, bots out. We want to keep bots out, we want to make sure everyone's having a good time, no one feels threatened, and... We want to make sure that the Discord also feels like a safe place where people can engage and talk if they'd like to.
that I like ask you to like clip things every now and again. Okay, let's go. I can feel the burn. I hurt. Like, I am pessimistic myself. But how can I clip when I'm trying to keep you alive? Hmm? I don't need you to keep me alive. I'm perfectly capable of staying alive myself. Lest you forget our original plate you have to roar it together, I was the tank. Thank you. Hey, Barrow is different. I don't know how to I don't know how to handle Barrow yet. Ugh. I wasn't very... Shut up. Shut up, okay? Shut up. Go away. Don't actually go this day. <laughs> I am an avid Uber tank, but I can play other roles. Look, I play a lot of roles, I play whatever is needed, but like, I make mistakes a lot. But I am also the one that encouraged to, that encouraged Gina to... I am also the one that, uh, encouraged Gina to beat Moonlord or Moonlord, really? Well, that was a long time ago, though. You like to be prepared. I like to run in head first and attempt everything. Whether I'm prepared or not. That fight was a slog, but it was fun. Same with me though, what do you mean? You like to just run head first and maybe the way you're poor whether prepared or not. I mean, that fight was a flaw, but it was, like, so much fun for me. I need to get a Pach- I need to get a Pachi's classes and grab a commander so I have an act- have a dedicated kill button? That doesn't sound fun. Bounce the boba. I just, I like running in head first. Whether it's like... Whether it doesn't matter what it is I'm doing, what it is I'm playing. 
if someone is like, okay, we need to take time and prepare and we need to do this and this and this and this and that and this and that and this and that, I'd be like, no, oh, fuck it, I'm going in. I can't tell you like how funny it was to go into like big fights in Final Fantasy XIV having absolutely no idea what to do. I still remember the one time I was playing with my sibling on Final Fantasy XIV and we were doing the Eden, the Eden vs. Normal mode. Uh, one of the tanks forgot to put their tank stance on, so like... So like, I I was playing Mokka at the time, which is like extremely high damage burst. So I start by opening with like an extremely large burst of damage, and I get this marker over my head. I'm like, oh, what is this? What is this? What is this? And I'm running back and forth, you know, pressing my buttons. It's just screaming out in discord. What is this? What is this? What is this? And then I stop. I think for a moment. And I say, I'm like, is this a tank buster? And then, next thing you know, me and my sibling are both dead. Just straight up dead. Sing here, my GF plays games was a formulated and strategic method, and she hates playing with me. Ugh. <laughs> uh. I love playing games with other people, it makes her just such varying kinds of entertainment. I mean, I just, I remember going into the moon more fight with you, Gina, and I was like, we're gonna die anyways, why don't we at least try? And you just, please fuck her all it. And we won. We won. Sure, sure, sure. There was a group effort. Also, like, what you expect? It was like first time fighting Moonmark. What the streamer have her now? He will fight you. No need to fight. No need to fight. I know that at the time I was a tank and I did like very little damage. I did like very minimal damage, but like I did my best. But we won anyways, so it doesn't really matter to me. I was just happy that we actually took took on the impulse and we survived. In the end. Cause there was only you were just gonna let yourself die like a world of reset into a state where we needed to break the crystals for the moon lord again. I just wanted to have fun. And I had fun. So that's my W. You had the spawner, it was not consumable. I didn't care. It was my first fight against it. I wanted to fight it. We fought it. We won. End of discussion. I don't care. I had fun and that is what mattered and that's what matters in a video game. Not just like going into a situation prepared.
Hence why we need to go for Twitch controls the game. So neither of us have a choice. I, again, I will consider it. I will consider it. I make absolutely no promises. Like the hive. Look, I think like if I know my Twitch chat community at the moment, I think it's filled with people who would both be beneficial and detrimental. Time of Woody? Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm keeping track of time. Oh no, um, well, I'm not actually leaving at 3 o'clock. I just have to end stream at 3 o'clock because I need to eat, I need to take a shower, and I gotta get ready. My shift doesn't start until 5 o'clock. So I'll be fine. Don't worry about it. I have seen playthroughs of Subnautica and I am... Nah, I, I don't want... But also, like, we played Vero, but like, Vero is not a first person. Like, I don't handle love specifically well. But as I'm sure the deepest on something I cannot see approaches me. Yay, enjoy your emotes. They were some very great creations. Yes, it's behind me, is it? But... I just don't particularly handle horror... very well. 
so like, I'm not very adamant about jumping into horror games. Depends on the brand of horror for me. Like, I suppose that is fair. When it comes to, like, actual horror and watching people play horror games, I'm not easily gotten. But that's like watching people play games and not playing them myself. I think to make it easier for Mizo, someone should join her in multiplayer type horror. I mean, there's not a lot of multiplayer type horror games and... The only real multiplayer horror game I have is fucking... Fast Phobia. So, Devil in Liar Chainsaw Game, Brave for 13th Rock List. I have Dead by Daylight. I prefer playing this killer, but I have it. Bro. Yeah, those other two. I don't know about Chainsaw Game, I don't really think I've seen that one. But, like, Friday the 13th, uh, no, no, thank you. My daylight felt sour to me. I'm sorry to hear that, Gina. That's a really interesting game if you're playing with friends. Chainsaw Massacre Man. Like, you could reference all kinds of horror films and horror games. I would have absolutely no idea what to talk about because I've never seen any of them. I suck at DVD. I'm decently okay. Da do a game with a friend and others. I got pummeled down and upon them old and bored as they laugh. I mean, that's kinda how multiplayer kind of works in that game. Like, I had some pretty nice moments when I was playing DVD. Well, I mean, the only part that really sticks out from what you just told us is that, uh... Is that the only real part I have to say about, like, talk to players in the timeline. That's like the only real part that kind of sticks out to me about that. Cause I don't I don't like when people tunnel hider. But um I've had some pretty good moments in Dead by Daylight. I have I mostly play Huntress if I'm a hunter. Uh, I've made some pretty amazing, like, shots with the hatchets. And I prefer having a long range of ways to actually, you know, hit people. I was playing with some friends and I was chasing one of the other people. But I decided to let them go, because I didn't want to tunnel them. And instead I walked up behind another one of the players. We were they were in the Discord call, Smith. We peer each other. And all I see is Hey there. He turns around and he pretty much screams as I'm pretty much standing right behind him. I didn't hit him. I wouldn't run away. And then like we took turns playing as the Never told me down, not even uh, her. No one even her once. It was very start. Like I just started playing the game. That is the issue. They went after me due to me being a newbie. Took me down. Waited for one to gather and gourmet in front of them. Then scouted and joked about my inability and all that. 
I left since I'm not there to be bored with their amusement every round since that is what was happening. Well, I hate to tell you, Gina. You just played with some shit people. Personally, I'd say give the game another chance with some people that aren't gonna do that to you. You were not the issue. In that situation, with what you described, you were not the issue whatsoever. Well, they can go at themselves. But, like I said, you should definitely give the game another try with people who aren't gonna do that to you. Cause I can certainly tell you, I wouldn't do that. In a game where I'm the killer against my friends, chances are I'm not gonna kill anyone. Cause that's just my way of playing, like, I'm not here to, like, win. I'm here to have fun, I'm gonna throw hatchets at you, I'm gonna sneak up on ya, I'm gonna... I'm eventually gonna hook you maybe once or twice, but, like, even when annoying against my sibling, which when it comes to my sibling, I was like, let me have them. The rest of you can go. And my sibling was like, if I get off a hook and I escape, you have to let me go. Uh, Alright. So they attempted to get off hook. And they got off the hook. I was like, well crap, alright then. Let's go. So like there's... There's a very small chance if I actually like kill her, I'm actually gonna, I'm actually gonna, hi, I'm actually gonna hook anyone. Yeah, it was rough, and it was the first time, and was hoping they showed me the ropes and all that. Yeah. Dear, you, you just played with some pretty shit people. Like, if you if you wanted to give them a try, with some people that... Like, they have people in the Discord. You know, that, that, that Discord we sure together that invited you to. Like, there are people with Dead by Daylight in there that's not gonna do that. And like... We can eventually just like get people together and have a good time. And here we can give you like an actual good gaming experience with that right there, like. Hopefully make it fun. of the day then but for right now it is getting close for me it's the time to go so unfortunately i'm going to have to call the end of the stream soon enough oh mind if i get hooked first and all that since that just means i was spall at first uh what was a theatrical show it was also legion yeah legion Okay. Come on, one at a time with the wedgies, guys. One at a time. What you is in place.
Brother drives up one, I guess. Okay, that sounds wonderful, Dina. We will work together and we'll decide something else fun. No idea what it's gonna be, but we'll work on it. Promise. It's gonna be great. There was a story I meant to tell about the video and actually I remember one of my first times playing. I actually had gone through pretty much an entire round. When I didn't get spotted a single time. He was playing one of the guys was playing like a like the pig, the one that traps people in like the jigsaw traps. And it was it was extremely funny. Like watching people go around they had to like stop and heal people. Never got caught, never not seen, never got hit. And I found the hatch at the end. It's a very interesting kind of game, cause most of the time I was just playing like stealth. Hiding in like like tall grasses and whatnot. Ah, oh, barely an update, yeah. That was added recently. Perfect hunter. Uh, I don't know about that. I have bruises on my arm. Weird. Zach Zol, thank you for the follow him be brave or what you redeems, um... Okay. What, you can throw these wedges but you never live up to me? Gina, are you saying? Get yourself ready? Yeah, I should get ready for work. Well, it's been a great stream talking to all of you. I've had a lot of fun. I got some stuff off my chest. And I made a little announcement that we'll no longer be making schedules. So, since it's the end of the video, I will once again say if you are watching that this saying this because they actually watched you IRL. Fair. 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 Oh, but yes, um... If you're watching from Twitch, please make sure to follow the channel. It really helps us out. And if you're watching from the future on YouTube, please make sure to subscribe to the channel, because that helps us grow our YouTube community and allows us to, you know, the, the more people we get, the higher chances that the sound gets noticed. And the higher the sound gets noticed, the more people we get, the more people we get, the more progress we can make. The more progress we can make, the more games we can play. And eventually, if, you know, the channel gets big enough and we start making money from, like, Palm Down? No, you come down. Uh, but yes. If we do get, like, bigger, and the channel starts, like, making money, then, like, I can make longer streams, pretty much. 
basically, more people means more content. So yeah. Also, if you're watching from YouTube, put the video a like or something. You can comment too if you'd like to. It's free. You always change it. Oh uh, yes, content. Yes, content. Content. That's what we're doing here. So, once again, thank you guys for coming. Thank you for all the wedgies. Thank you for the subs and the follows. Oh, are very much appreciated. I love every one of you. Thank you so much. Well, that is it for today. And I will see you guys next time we decide to stream. Which could be tomorrow. If I'm feeling up for it. I'll get back to you guys on that. Um, but the next day I will have free to stream starts on... Well, besides tomorrow starts on Sunday. So, we might have a stream on Sunday. So look forward to that. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye for now. Yay, happy old day. Oh, like, I think sleep. in the